Can you please update us briefly what do you see at the site because you are the first investigative team who entered the site of the plane crash? Very briefly. Okay, well, we're um, right now, this is our second day here. We're looking at a very, very badly damaged piece of, piece of earth where I, it looks like where the engines and the fuel tanks uh, landed. The, um, the intensity of the fire was very, very strong here that I think bodies and other material belongings basically vaporized. Um, it basically looks like a war zone here. There's um, a lot of journalists around. There's a lot of security, uh, people with heavy arms. Uh, we're being watched very carefully. The new development today was that uh, they are what they described as uh, experts, so-called experts here. They brought body bags with them. They're moving the uh, bodies at least to the side of the road. Did you, did you try to approach these people to find out who they are and where do they take the bodies? Well, we have to be very careful with our movements. We're restricted because there is so much uh, security around. We, we've explained who we are and what we need to do, but we're basically, our movements are being uh, quite controlled at the moment. What do these people explain? Why do they not allow you to enter the site for the examination? Well, there's not much explanation given. It's basically yes or no. And uh, we, yeah. are, we are unarmed civilians, so we're not in a position to uh, argue um, heavily with people with heavy arms. The reason we're here is to establish the facts and uh, to report on them. We're looking at things like security on the perimeter of the crash site. We're looking at uh, the same condition of the bodies. We're looking at the status and condition of the debris and also personal belongings. There's a lot of uh, uh, interest, obviously, in the what happened to the, to the data boxes. Yeah. And uh, we haven't been given any answers on that. We've asked to speak to a commander or a leader, but they haven't produced any. So uh, that, is, that, that still remains an unanswered question.